Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard today as we are on episode two and we are in a very not happy looking doubling, very cloudy today. Uh, we're going to hop into the Ryanair livery again um, and we're going to go from Dublin over to Cardiff so that will tick off Ireland and Wales and then time if time if there's enough time we will then do Cardiff over to Cambridge to tick off England so that will be three countries done thus far um, don't forget guys this is a new series so there will be a lot of episodes so make sure you hit the subscribe button and the like button uh, accompanying me on this flight today will be Adam and he will be in a another Ryanair I understand so good morning Adam morning so there we go you have not logged on yet I'm guessing because I'm the only plane here uh, I'll lock on now okay cool um, so I hope you're well guys uh, this video will go up today at some point and we will keep or I will keep the videos coming every single day um, and as I've said before there are four live streams a week Monday Wednesday Friday and Saturday and then on top of that we get um, oh you're over there how are you managing to be oh you've already pushed back I was like how you managed yeah, to okay. face out <laughs> um, and then there'll be these episodes uploaded every single day so I hope you enjoy this world the round trip uh, around the world on a 737-800 so as I said guys don't forget to subscribe there'll be a lot of episodes for you to enjoy and also to hit the like button right let's uh, hop in our plane and do the pushback as with yesterday if you watched yesterday's first episode the plane is all set up and ready to go and it's been done that way to avoid uh, wasting back. time so literally we are ready to push back clearance has been obtained and the plane is ready to taxi out to the uh, runway every now and then I will do a full setup um, but just not every video because let's be honest you're here to watch the takeoffs maybe do watch the flying and then the landing um, and it can be a bit boring for you guys watching uh, us doing uh, a setup on the plane every single time um, so we'll try it this way and we see how we go and then sort of once a week I'll set the Boeing up so for those that want to see how the Boeing set up I'll do it for you Because I got my sound switched off. Uh, my sound switched off as well. No, your engines must be on. Oh, my engines are on, yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm picking up. Oh, thought you Because <laughs> you're, you're, you're right Pretty behind much. me. <coughs> right, guys. So let's go flaps 15. Uh, flaps 5 even. Okay, we're just pushing back nicely now. Let's get those on. And let's get those on. Thank you very much. Have I pushed my plane into yours or am I just missing you? Uh, yeah, you come a long way back there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because obviously when I started Operation working... Operation complete. Go ahead and set the parking brake. When I initially set my uh, pushback, when I initially set it, my pushback, you weren't online. I had no idea where you were, but I knew I wanted to come back here so I could veer off to the left. Uh, I see. So, all good fun. It's all good. It's all good. 
Okay. Right. Now I should warn you guys, I have never landed at Cardiff, nor has Adam. And we've never landed at Cambridge. So you should have some two interesting landings today. If nothing else. Okay, just gonna let. Uh, the code is disconnected and bypass pin has been removed. Hand signal on the right. We'll see you next time and have a safe flight. Thank you. Okay. Now, even though there's no ATC online, there could well be other players, so out of courtesy, uh, I will just make sure anyone that's around the airport knows that I'm on the move. Ryanair 901, uh, departing for runway 24 via Link 4, Hotel, Foxtrot, holding at Echo 1 for runway 24, uh, 28 left, sorry. Right, let's go guys. Are you ready to depart? I'm like just, yeah, are you ready to go? And you're not, not even, yeah, I'm yeah, not even I'm, asked you. I'm, I'm ready. Right, taxi lights can come on. Let's get underway. Let's remove back a bit from... Uh, our learning colleague the sound effects of his lovely engine shouldn't be coming through my ears so much okay so we're going to taxi out via link 4 theoretically you can go straight on to runway 3416 and take that down in fact we'll do that um, Ryanair 901, update to taxi to runway 28 left. Uh, we'll go out via Link 4, Hotel 1, runway 16 slash 34, down to runway 28 left. It's not in use, so runway 28, so 28 left is in use. They are building a new runway, but it hasn't happened yet. I believe they finished it, but it hasn't been site. Um, signed off yet as a new runway probably because with the current climate there isn't much need three, for two runways uh, I believe only Heathrow out of all the UK airports is still using two runways, uh, it's only started re using two runways again on runway one six two thousand two hundred feet remaining Okay, just taxiing down, and then we're going to do a sharp turn right onto runway 28 left. Got to say, after the Challenger, I, lo two, eight. I love being in this plane. I don't know what it is just do hundreds of flights I've logged in this Zebo on runway two eight right. 
Ryanair 901, runway 28 left, take off. Okay. You ready? I'm ready. Okie doke, let's do this. Okay. like to hand fly the plane for a little bit but just or has it's an enjoyable plane to hand fly okay over to autopilot and let's have a look as we do take off So initial climb 5,000 feet and then we're going to turn back towards the runway to go to our first waypoint which will be Dexon. Okay, that's all good, we're in the climb. Reap the speed up. Flaps can come up. RTO brakes can come off now and we'll set it for two for Cardiff. Just one of those things, do it now and then you won't forget. That's to go. Okay, we're going to start our turn. And here we go. How many times have you been on a flight and you hear the engines power right back and you think they've actually switched off? <laughs> you get that, that sink, sinking feeling as the engines power right off and you think, oh my god, the engines aren't working. The engines have calmed down. What's going on? <laughs> What's we doing? haven't got to the right altitude yet. What's he doing? Exactly. And then you realise... No, it's just because he's turning and he's reached the altitude he needs to be at for the initial climb. Comment below, guys, if you know what I'm referring to. <laughs> I've, so many times I've taken off on Ryan airplanes and that's exactly what's happened. And you think, same thing. <laughs> I mean, I fly, sim I fly simulators, but I'm the worst flyer. <laughs> Are you flying? <laughs> Are we flying will... into 12 or 30? 30. 30. I will literally, I have been known to take a 12 hour boat ride to avoid getting on a plane. <laughs> it just makes a mockery of the fact that I play, or I get involved in flight sims. I can't be on my own guys, I really can't, don't forget, hit the like button guys and subscribe. We're on our way to Wales, uh, country number three, as we've already done Scotland, we've left Ireland. Wales is our next one, and then England. So that'll take us on to four countries so far in two days. Right, we're at 5,000 feet. We're now gonna climb up to our cruising altitude, which I think I said was 230, didn't we? Yes. Yeah, I think it was, yeah. Three zero. The hand of God is bringing me a cup of tea. Oh no, she's going to make a cup of tea. Uh, yep, two three zero. So at Dexon, we want to be at twelve thousand feet. Let's set. Oh, P nav. Here we go. 
There we go. We're now climbing through the pea soup, as I like to call it. And then you hear those powerful engines kicking in. And we'll climb. We're still maintaining um, our current 250 until we're above 10,000. looks happy so our route today will take us to take some of these off there perfect our route today will take us over uh, across the Irish Sea over the top of Manchester down by the side of Birmingham and then curve round to come in at the bottom at Cardiff uh, we'll be landing just off of the, uh, the sea again for this landing according to my route. Yep, we'll be coming around the very bottom. Right, let's set up our arrival. And we will... seem happy so the ILS so we get that all set up now guys will be are you listening 110.7 Seven. Put that into that one, and our course heading will be two nine seven for the ILS. So that's the plane all set up for our arrival. There we go, guys. All right, sit back, relax, and then uh, enjoy our flight. Uh, ETA approximately 35 minutes into Cardiff.
you don't want to scare your uh, audience. Oh my god. That will teach you. Don't just sit in pants all day. I've got my dressing gown on at the moment. Yeah. Bells we go. And Thomas. Two hundred ninety four knots, you mean? You got your uh, speed, your ground speed. One knot is equal to 1.1507945 miles per hour. Informative, shall we just say. <laughs> <laughs> That's like when you use that thing and it says zero 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 point. <laughs> Quite different. Because it's nautical miles, isn't it? Not... Yeah. Have a look at the flights, how we're doing. Oh, yeah. You know, you haven't filed a flight plan, right? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> There's nobody on mine, so there's no point. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll do it now just in case someone comes on. It'd be your luck that someone would. Yeah, that's true. There's eight people taking off from uh, Manchester. Manchester's always quite busy. There's only seven at Gatwick, and they've got Ground Tower online as well.
got to say, I don't like the new uh, file in a flight plan. Really well, it makes you go to a web browser to do it. Yeah. Yeah, I and said the same. More saying, details in as well. Yeah. You really need Simbrief. As long as you've done it, you've done it by Simbrief. Simbrief will put it all in there for you. Passing over the Isle of Anglesey. You must tell me more about these things. What, you got it from explain.org? Uh, yeah, I think so. It's called a better camera, ABC. Hmm. So I what, you... Aircraft from and, you and you can click into any aeroplane? Yeah. Oh, that's sick. That would be kind of cool for my stream. Hmm. Even I can even zoom into uh, aircraft carriers that are nearby. Not so interesting, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> We don't do military operations on here. I'm still showing as a Challenger 6... 650 on mine. But when I was parked next to you, what did I look like? Challenger. Did I not... Ch I swear not I changed it. That's him. <laughs> no, but... Maybe I filed the flight plan wrong. Uh, don't rule that out. Uh, no, Boeing 738, no. No, that's all spot on. So the only thing I could have done, let me disconnect and reconnect. Maybe, yeah, you're right. I didn't change it from a challenger. There you go. 
now if you zoom into me, I don't know, once it refreshes, it normally takes about 30 yeah. seconds or so. There we go, it's done. I'll tell you when to zoom in in a minute because I'm about to make my turn and it'll look kind of cool from whatever perspective it is that you're using. I'll share my screen on Discord so you can see. Oh uh, yeah, do it. Mm -hmm. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Because I want to see this. Yeah, I'll, that's my plane there. Yeah. And then I can go... There you are, 901. Yeah. Oh, that's sick. Imagine you having a little cheeky app like that and not telling me before now. <laughs> I didn't even know it did it till last night. I was messing around with it. Got all sorts on here. All this stuff. But yeah, can can see that guy taxiing out. On, on grass. grass. <laughs> and a lot of others on grass. <laughs> So I don't think it's perfect in every sense of the word. It's just not loading the scenery, is it, to save resources, I think. Maybe you need to turn it on. on approach somewhere. Yeah, again, resource limited by the looks of it. Yeah. But you're right in front of me, so I can... I'd say that'd be quite a strain on the game, though. Then my FPS doesn't drop. Six the FPS. Yeah, look at me now, because I'm about to make my turn. Look. I'm actually doing it. That's kind of cool. I'm definitely going to have to get that app. Keep an eye on the top of the scent. No, it's all right. We're all good. We'll set our descent for our top of altitude. So, in case I forget, set it at ten thousand initially. It's a nice little add on that. Yeah, it is. Keep a gap. Otherwise, you'll be stalling to try and. What altitude you're at? 23. Yeah. I've got a 50 knot tailwind there. <laughs> oh, okay. Are you not re are you using live weather? Yeah. Oh.
I'm gonna go and quickly make a cup of coffee. Yeah, no worries. Okay, we're starting our descent now for Cardiff. Well, 
I'll just give it a little bit of drag just to help the plane maintain speed. Very low ILS, 1600 feet. He's back and starting my descent now into Cardiff. Yeah, Just in you, time. your flight plan is still not uploaded. Oh. Still showing you oh, with well. no flight plan. Not that it I'm makes any difference. Next flight. Yeah. Um, the ILS interception is at 1,600 feet. Very, very, very low. Yeah. Very, very low. We will put on the uh, yoke cam and um, throttle cam as uh, we pick up the ILS guys. Okay, I'm doing a speed intervention to bring it down to 250 knots. Just if you keep the same gap up, that would work good. Okay. Don't like to rush my approaches, even if that means they take a couple of minutes longer. No, that's fine.
flying over the Welsh valleys. Yeah, indeed. Okay, uh, stop screening and look at my screen and there's a shortcut to be taken. Okay. Uh, let me just stop watching your screen. Oh, there we go. So, as you approach, uh, uh, I'll screen, I'll share, I'll screen in. As you approach Dobham. Yeah. Yeah. Set your heading. The one, round around the 184 mark, just before these white lines. That's the runway in. And then you can take the shortcut in, but then make sure you're descending on or around 2,300, yeah. Okay. And you'll you'll get it down in time to make that turn. It'll just save a lot of faffing around. Um, well, the speed brakes come out to help slow down the plane. Okay guys, we're taking a little crafty shortcut here, that's uh, going to intercept the ILS. It'll save us doing a sort of round robin over the top of the runway, then left round at a big loop and then back down again, so this shortcut will just trim a bit of time off it. sort of industrial part down there guys a big one quite a large one well shop Don't isn't it probably and <laughs> they just about everywhere somewhere along that line there is our airport Sending nicely here. So let's get uh, the local Q and H, and the local Q and H is ten twelve. Let's go over to standard at ten twelve. Always remember to set it on both screens, guys. If you can remember, I would always your life a little bit easier. Oh, wrong one. This one. There we go. Only just out though. Nothing major. We're going to level off just in time to be able to make this turn, so that's quite good. And as things happen very quickly, I'm going to turn on yoke cam and uh, throttle cam now. Because these things all seem to happen very quickly. Okay, they can come on, they can come on, they can come on. Seatbelt signs can come on. 
crew know that we are coming into land. Very nicely nice here. So I just need to get the speed off. Um, but because of the angle of attack. Picked up the ILS, that's good. I just need to level off. Thank you. Thousand ago. We'll just set that actually at 2000. We're a bit far out on the ILS. We're above the ILS, that's all that matters. Now we're just going to get the speed off. And then we'll fly just slightly past the ILS and then turn onto the ILS. So down to 210 and even 190 now can come into play Taking the shortcut as well, Adam? Yes, I am, yeah. yeah. So the runway is off to our right over there, guys. Okay, let's go laps five. Down to 180. Hit the approach button. It's coming around nicely. Autopilot second, autopilot engaged. Coming around now. Nice little shortcut that's going to save us possibly another 12 or so minutes off the arrival down to 170 have a quick look outside Looking good so far. Planes turning onto the ILS. Landing gear can come down. It'll be a bit of a murky arrival, but you know. We'll do what we can. Hey, down to one sixty. Laps fifteen. Connects into the ILS nicely. Down to 150. And we'll go flaps 30. My flaps 30 seems to think it's flaps 40. Go 
lap 30. Cool. Okay. Seven miles out. Got it. Traffic Rhino 901 approaching runway 30. Seven mile final. Okay. Looking good. ILS is coming down. We're locked onto the ILS. Cool. We're all good here. And there's our runway there goes. Right there on the edge of the sea. So it's going to take a... Make sure you get it right. <laughs> okay, down to 140. Speed brakes set two. Everything's looking good. Sending nicely with the ILS. One forty at four DME. This does not, I don't think this has got ILS three. Adam? No, it's fine. Okay. I know you're a pro, you won't need it, but felt like it was necessary to say it. Hey guys. One mile out, I will take over the plane. Uh, the exit off the runway will be to our right. Thousand feet stabilized, Mr. Perch altitude set. Approaching three zero. Thank you. So we will be looking to exit possibly at the end of the runway on this one, guys. Okay. Okay, my plane. Hundred check. Four hundred. Three hundred. Two hundred. Two hundred check. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Long landing, long landing, 4,000 feet remaining. remaining okay. that's a retracted nicely Welcome to Cardiff. Not quite sure why there's a Delta parts up here, but you know, okay. We have a long landing, but in down the runway, but we were fine. It was just a bit long, but it's no biggie. 
Cool. I'll bring you back to the uh, flight deck. How are you getting on, Adam? Yeah, I'm just about six miles out. Okay, cool. There's a little cheeky delta in there. I presume it may it might be going in there to uh, possibly um, have work to be uh, brought over to a cargo plane. There's a DHL in there as well. Loading up. Yeah, there's some DHL work going on in there. For a free airport, it's quite well modelled, I have to say. Mm -hmm. Yeah, quite well modelled. Right, we'll just put our pedal down a bit so we can watch our learny collie come in. Let's have a look. Find somewhere to park. Oh, there's loads of parking here. I've got to say, guys, I'm quite impressed with this airport. Okay. Go over here. And then we'll go into here. And we can watch as our colleague comes in to land. There we go. Cool. Parts up. Welcome to Cardiff. And I see our learning colleague is on his way in. Let's see if there's a tower view. There is, but not the best. Oh, we should be alright. We'll make it work. Here comes our colleague in. Take your time. Oh, oh! Did we take a bounce? We took a bounce, yeah. Uh, we took a bit of a cheeky bounce there, I fancy. I'm down there. Oh, oh yeah, you're down. <laughs> <laughs> no doubt, no doubt. I suspect that's the first time that Cardiff's had two Ryanair flights coming in at once. For some reason, my uh, throttle Brakes. didn't turn off. Are you going off the runway? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> my going... throttle didn't turn off. I turned it's everything got... off. For some He's reason, gone off I'm down turned... the hill. <laughs> for some reason, the sim did not um, register that I turned the auto throttle off. I kept it on full throttle. Oh, don't worry, just do a circle, come back up. <laughs> oh, my word. Oh, you got to laugh at you guys. If you didn't laugh, you'd cry. <laughs> you truly would. Right, guys, so that's got us into Cardiff. So our next flight is to Cambridge. I'm currently on the main road into the host into the airport. <laughs> what are you doing? Driving up the main road into the airport. Nice. Right, so we are at E G F F. Uh, so we're not worried about the gate number. So let's go E G F F. And we are going to Cambridge next. Uh, so let me pull up that one. Uh, I meant to uh, give you a round of applause for that one, but I totally forgot to do it. 
<laughs> how, how to go off the wrong way at the end. Here we go. Just, just, just for you. Here we go. There it is. Round of applause for my colleague there for not stopping at the end of the wrong way. Yeah. And you told me you were professional. Right. Well, I don't know why the sim didn't realise that my throttle was idle, but it just carried on to full throttle. So I had to... I didn't realise till it was too late, and then I had to turn it up and turn it back off again, just to get it to register. Sounds good. Right, runway 30 will be our chosen choice today for our departure. Let's go ahead and activate that, execute that. And then our departure will be from runway 30. Not the world's greatest amount of choices here, but basically that one. Execute. Back to the root page, next page. So from BCN, we will be going. See, there will be occasions, guys, where you will see me set the plane up. When we're doing a double flight uh, over to Kennet. If you ever look at the end of the runway, you'll see me where I should have been. <laughs> oh, hold on. We've got, we've got to see this, haven't we, guys? Let's got to see. Here he comes. Look, look. There he comes. Oh, <laughs> he's taking a scenic route. <laughs> <laughs> oh, unbelievable. I did give you a round of applause, it's all good. Uh, to Sylvia. Uh, sorry, what was we doing? Q63 to Kennet. Oh, and then we got direct, okay. To Sylvia. Okay, direct to Sylvia. Always pick the top one, usually right. Execute. Departure and arrival. We are taking runway ILS 23 and then coming in via Sylvia. She's there. There's lots of transmissions, but no idea, so I'm just going to go like last time and not bother. Okay, let's go across to the Perfinite page and let's file this route and see how much fuel we need. Okay, so we need a block fuel of 6,000 tonnes. So we'll put 7,000 in again. We always like to carry an extra tonnage of fuel. Um, again, once we go over Luton, we may, may take a bit of a cheeky shortcut on this one because it looks like it's just begging for it, to be honest. Just turn that down a bit because are you not seriously seeing me parked here? <laughs> I don't what are you doing? I'll move do I? <laughs> Please, you're literally inside my cockpit. Right. I just wanted to show that all my passengers are still alive. <laughs> Even if they did get the scenic group. Right, totally put me off now, forgotten what I was doing. <laughs> like, why is these engines so loud? And then I realised why. Flight level will be 160, very low altitude flight, this one, guys. Uh, average winds are 267 at 48. And the temperature is nine on this one. Reserves of 1.0. Cost index will again will be at 20. I know guys that watch my channel, they're like, what? Why are you using cost index 20? You never use cost index 20. It's always uh, 69. Oh. Right, let's just 
Wind that back to 525. All the way back, all the way back, all the way back. Just past the 5. That'll do. It's only got to be on average. Cool, that's fine. So, seat belts all done. Everything's set. Turn the taxi lights off for now. So we'll just wait for our learned colleague to set up his plane and then we'll get underway again, guys. Yeah, sorry about that. No, you're alright. Quite funny. Listen, traffic 7 air 1 Lima Sierra, take off from me 2 7 Baden 1 entry. Oh, get a bit of uh, it's SSA. Let's set this back up to 180. And we'll set this up to 5000 for our initial climb. Oh, long nav can come on. Turn off the approach mode. Don't get caught out with that one. Leaving your approach mode on. Cool, we're all good to go. Oh my god, Adam. Why are you just parked? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, well, why not? What the hell? <laughs> I'm just going to park Budget across airline, a couple of Paul. gates. <laughs> Budget airline. Yep. Across flying British Airways, I'd be in a nice gate with a jet plane and everything. Well, yeah, because they pay for them. Right, let's file our flight plan. Cool, that's done. And now let's go to Vatsby, just to make sure there's no one around. Had we have gone to Bristol, which wouldn't have been in Wales, so therefore that's why I did not to go there, we would have had ground controllers on. <sighs> Definitely a plus. There is actually another flight coming in. Uh, British, oh, it's the British Airway one that took off. Cool. Uh, I like how the waypoint's called Bacon. Bacon? You got Bacon a... 1 Alpha. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it is, isn't it? I'm just waiting for that to refresh. Uh, Hopefully once that refreshes, there we go. It's got me going to EGSC, which is just over there. Cool. Right, I'm going to do my pushback. Oh, one second. So we're going to go for a pushy backy. Pushy backy. A pushy backy. Please show me where you want to go. Oh. Ground and cockpit. Tow is driving up. And we'll be taking off from runway 30, which is where we landed. So we will push out up Alpha to Alpha 1. Runway three zero. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do. And we'll uh, head over to Cambridge for our second country stop today, guys. Just as a reminder, if you're tuning in now, uh, we've just flown over from Dublin into Wales to knock off two countries. And uh, that sounded wrong. 
and now we're going to fly over to Cambridge to make okay. it. Okay, all doors and hatches are closed. Ready to connect. Make it our third island country to visit. Then tomorrow we will be taking off from Cambridge going to France. So that's something to look forward to for tomorrow. And from France we will head up towards Norway. So that will be two more countries knocked off tomorrow. Uh, and we will be being, we will be being, we will be jet two tomorrow. So, times are a changing. So connected and bypass pin and inserted. Just about ready. Okay, okay, I'm just pushing back. Starting pushback. Okay, pushing back, guys. Here we go. What was that app called? Better Camera? Uh, it's called A, B A Better Camera. A Better Camera. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Definitely going to look that up. Because I was thinking on the event... Uh, you know when there's a big event on, so therefore there's a lot of planes coming out of a specific airport? Yeah. That would be really handy because I have mm. traffic global, which allows me to zoom in on I I um, I oh my god IRL lot planes. Yeah. Um, well, I didn't. Know, uh, that would be great for Vaxim. Parking brake is set. So on departure, two thousand three hundred feet around to the right for our departure. She's disconnecting tow. The taxi lights can come on. Tow is disconnected and bypass pin has been removed. Hand signal on the left. We'll see you next time and have fun up there. Oh. Right. Let's, uh, I'm going to start taxiing. Remember, it's single runway use. But you can taxi up behind me, like, you know? Yeah, yeah. Cool. Alright, let's go guys. Best way to visit uh, Cardiff, in and out as quickly as possible. Uh, as we pull away from our learned colleagues, very loud engines. Just think it's funny that your, your engines are louder than mine. Are you, are you using an engine mod? No. Wow, that seems making your engine sound so loud. Hey, we're taxi out to runway three zero. Kind of traffic, Ryanair 901, taxi into runway 30 via Alpha, holding at Alpha 1. Okay. 
London control is on like centre. No, they don't control Wales. But they will pick up on us when we're in flight because they control centre. You hear what I said, Adam? Yes. So make sure you file the flight plan this time. Well, it's entirely up to you, but they're going to be asking why you haven't filed one. Pretty sure they don't control this area. Well, they'd call if they did. You behind me? You taxi? No, I'm following the flight plan. Oh, okay. Okay. Approaching runway 30. Wait for my learning colleague to start taxiing. Let me know when you start taxiing, mate. Okay. It'll be a great shot light as I go out. Parking brakes. Parking brakes off. Uh, make sure the plane's not chocked. Tap, tap your brakes. So. There we go. Yeah. Ooh, it's always the most obvious things. He says. Haven't been there a few times himself. Right. Flaps five. I'm not talking. Can never get these things to sit in. There we go. Flaps five. Cool. Are you taxiing now? Yeah, I am indeed. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. Ryanair nine zero one, Alpha one, runway thirty at Cardiff. Onto the runway we go. Checking, there's no one coming in. There is not. Let's get with the landing lights. Taxi lights can come off. Cool. Okay, guys, I will bring up roll cam and approaching three zero. On runway three zero. Oh, lining up on the runway. And brakes on. Okay. Auto thrust on. And then it pops off. Couldn't be me. Uh, I'm not sure why that's not engaging. We may have to do this old school. Okay. Didn't know that it did that. Put your foot hard down on the brakes and it turns off uh, the brakes. Right, guys, mm. let's go. Uh, and that worked this time, so let's go for it. Right, Toga. Here come, here comes Cambridge. Yep. Yeah. 
Security. And pull back. Positive right. Positive right. Wheels up. A bit of hand flying first. Couldn't be me that the auto throttle has just flicked itself off. A bit of wind, so let's bank her over. Even a climb. One thousand. The auto throttle's come off again. I don't know what's wrong with this auto throttle. Let's go that way. Yeah, the auto throttle's not happy. Right, there we go. There we go. We sorted it. We got there in the end, guys. Okay. Speed up to 250. Flaps can come clean. Cool. Cool. And we're just making our turn now. Everything's looking very nice indeed. We'll keep the climb on. Uh, 170 will be our cruising altitude for this trip. There it is. We're going to keep rocketing up. Go over to standard. Lovely jubbly. Goodbye Wales. Hello Cardiff, I mean Cambridge. See our learning colleague is going down the runway there. As we pass through 10,000 feet.
Yeah, let's make it up. I'm not really sure what's going on with it. I mean, it's building up now. Engines are fine. Don't know. It's weird. Just as it was the fact that it didn't want to put on the auto throttle as well. Don't know. Check. That's why I was looking around the plane, make sure everything was as it should be. Like flaps are up, wheels are up, air brakes aren't involved. But it did seem a bit low when it's come up. But no, everything's fine. We don't need to tell anyone that happened. Right, so let's. This is a very short flight, guys, so just gonna set everything up for our arrival into. Kynebridge. 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 They don't even <laughs> talk like that. <laughs> no. Birmingham. That's Birmingham. Very cheapy chocolate guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, we're coming into runway two three, aren't we? Yes, we are. So that will give us an ILS of one 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 point three. We're already on that. Yeah, we're actually technically already on it. There we go. Very nearly, anyway. We have a course heading of, as you just po rightly pointed out, 230. 230. Coolios. Coolios. Uh, put the VNAV on now. Two, three, zero. There we go. Cool, cool, cool. That's all set. Have a look. Where's our top of descent? Quite lot, quite far down. So, quite far into the our departure. Right, I'm just gonna eat uh, something. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, okay. to you slurping on a sausage. <laughs> I can see you in front of me. I think I'm catching you up. Slow down a bit.
901 London Patrol, good morning, Silver, one Lima arrival, through direct Silver. Logan 1371, ready for taxi. Logan 1371, check to score 3251. Uh, Roger. Logan 1371, at your discretion, taxi hold point Echo 1 via Delta and Echo. Taxi only point uh, Echo 1 via Delta Echo. Logan 1371. Ryan at 85. Ryan at 85, Lotta Cajalo, Silver 1 Lima arrival. Ryan at 85, we're at Silver 1 Lima arrival. Ryan at 3 Foxtrot Mike, expect vectors for an ILS approach runway 22, descend flight level 110. Expect vectors ILS 22 and descend flight level 110, Ryan at 3 Foxtrot Mike. Speed bed 9980, climb now, flight level 140. Flight level 140, speed bed 9980. Yeah. I'm on 371, runway 33, clear takeoff, the surface winds 260 degrees, 7 knots. Clear takeoff, 33, log in 131. Yeah. Right now, 14 Quebec Yankee, clear runway 22. I don't want to talk about Yankee, thank you. Stand four, five left via Lima, Juliet, and Charlie. Good morning. Lima, Juliet, Charlie for four, five left. Thank you very much. Uh, have a good day. See you soon. Bye bye. Good. We've got 9980, Dane 2 Alpha arrival. Climb flight level 180. Dane 2 uh, 1 Alpha arrival and climb 180. We've got 9980. Good uh, afternoon, DC-782. DC-782, Romeo London Patrol, hello, climb now, flight level 220. Climb flight level 220, Yeah, yeah, I need to get dressed as well. fly to Milan to do some shopping. Logan 137, report your task, can I ask you, climb now, fly level 210. Passing 1200, climb 120, Logan 137. <laughs> he likes a bit of sausage. Flight heading 360 degrees. Right, heading 360 degrees. Did you say sorry? I did. Eighty seven two eight Romeo, route direct Brooklyn's Park. Uh, direct uh, Brooklyn's Park. Speedbird 9980, can you just confirm arrival runway and um, star for Liverpool? It's in 9980, uh, Keegan to Brava arrival. Um, I don't cover Liverpool, but I can give you the weather if you need it. Oh, so that's fine. Uh, Keegan to Bravo, and I've got the uh, weather thing ready. Thanks. Speedbird 9980. Sure. Uh, 
no free fox shot might fly heading two three zero degrees d seven flight level nine zero fly heading two three zero and send flight level nine zero to rhino three fox shot mike rhino eight five requesting flight level one seven zero uh, I'll wait till you turn the right way. It should have been a left turn heading 360. Uh, Runner 185, complete the loop and then resume your notification direct to Silver. Complete the loop and then resume your navigation to Silver, Ryan 185. I don't know if the plane just turned right, I don't know. Uh, 901, descend fly level 150, expect the NDB approach on May 23. If you terminate to run there, if possible, can we change out this is level 2, level 3, there's a... 7802, run me, yet no one's I sort out for you, climb for level 300. Climb for level 300. Under control, under under control, airy cargo nine four, Boeing seven seven three, at Stansted, stand four, I park clearance please to Munich. Airy cargo nine four, under control, hello to you, clear to Munich, Clacton one Echo departure, school seven zero two six. Munich has found on a Clacton one echo departure with a squawk of 7026. Here we cargo 94. Cargo 94, we're back correct. Sounds like it. 901, D7, flight level 80. Sounded like a very old man. Right then, 901, D7, flight level 80. Right, Clacton 85 when we're at Herb Suppression Rhino 85 when ready, decent flight level 150 level by silver. Rhino 85 to send flight level 150 direct to silver. Level by silver as well. Level by silver. Ready for push and start, please. Here we cargo 9 pull. Okay, I've got a full pitch out approved, QNH 1008. Push out approved, 1008, here we cargo 94. Right there, free fox shot, Mike, 30 miles, turn right, heading 290 degrees, descent to altitude 6000 feet, QNH 1008. Turn right, 290 degrees, and descend to altitude 6000 feet on QNH 1008, right there, free fox shot, Mike. Runway 901, speed 250 knots. Runway 1371, route direct to Southampton. Direct Southampton, slogan 1371. Descent to altitude 5,000 feet. Then altitude 5,000. Right, three feet from Mike. London Control, put the citation CJ4 at 5,000 feet via Sun Bubble 
throw me at the punch. Delta Charlie, India, the air trail under control. Hello to you. We're probably passing the altitude. Climb now, flight level 190. 5,000 feet to climb, flight level 190. Delta in the X-ray. Flight decent, flight level 100, on reaching flight level 100, speed 250 knots. Minor 85, sending flight level 100, we're reducing speed to 250 knots to one flight level 100. Ready for taxi now please, air with cargo 94. Air with cargo 94, taxi other point, Romeo 1, via Alpha Hotel, Romeo. Hold Romeo 1 by Alpha Hotel Romeo, here we car go 94. Right now, 3 4 shot, Mike, descend to actually 4,000 feet. 10 knots, choose 4,000 feet. Right now, 3 shot, what, Mike? Okay, now 1371, appear to have stopped climbing. I just confirmed you're still climbing up to 210. My bad. Uh, I thought it was clear to one two zero. That's good. Going to do one bad. zero. Look at one three seven one. Yep. Right now, nine zero one route direct. So, I'm going to have one uh, route direct Charlie Alpha Mike NDB to hold. Yep. Direct to Cambridge. Right now, right now 901, you descend to altitude 3,000 feet. And your living controlled airspace fire descent is a deconfliction service outside. Good nature, Cambridge is 1008. Three Fox on Mike, left 260 degrees, cleared our last approach 22. 3000, I think he said. Left 260 degrees and cleared our last two, uh, runway 22, right next to each other, Mike. Right now, 901, descent to 3000 feet, QNH 1008, clear to leave controlled airspace via descent, deconfliction service. Charlie, India, India X-ray, it's a Honolulu 1-Charlie arrival. Honolulu 1-Charlie arrival, that's an extract, thank you. Don't know, you're leaving his ass. Speedbird 9980, just land further ATC, continue on Unicom 122.8, bye-bye. Unicom 122.8, many thanks for service, have a great day, Speedbird 9980. Run out and G2, run out 3 Fox on Mike, runway 22, clear to land, wind 290 degrees, 7 knots. Clear to land, runway 22, run out 3 Fox on Mike. November 4 5, Whiskey Tango with you, flight level 160. November 4 5, Whiskey Tango, you're not in my set to continue on Unicom 1228, bye bye. Alright, 122 decimal 8, bye bye. What the hell? He said. Run at 85, descend flight level 80. Run at 85, descending flight level 80. I've expect the NDB approach from my 23 Cambridge. Expect an NDB approach from my 23 at Cambridge, right now, I don't know what NDB approach is.
Oh, NDB. If you go on arrival. If you go on arrival. And then choose your... Where it says runway. It says Come on, two, two, two. this is where our story ends this morning. Continue on, you need to come on to two decimal eight again. One, two, two, decimal eight. Many thanks. Bye bye. No, NDB two three. I don't know what difference that makes. An A5 uh, route direct to the Charlie Alpha Mike NDB to hold, descent to altitude 3,000 feet, clear to leave control to airspace via descent, deconfliction service outside. Gives you a fucking paragraph, doesn't it? What did he say? Descent to 3,000? Bye bye, runner 85, re back. Runner 85, send it to 3,000. We direct to the arm, hold, uh, leaving there, it's going to have deconfliction, I don't know what that means, I'm sorry. Okay, and A5, yeah, you're leaving control airspace, so after you leave control airspace, it's a deconfliction service. So with a deconfliction, all you'll get is traffic information and advice about avoiding action, it's not a radar service. Okay, okay thank you very much, Brian Area 5. Robins, we've got 847, good morning, Logan 2, hotel arrival, when ready, descend flight level 250, level 5, Logan. Logan 2, hotel, when ready, descend flight level 250, level 5, Logan 2, 847. Basically, yeah, so I'm going to hold, 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 So IE me is giving you a direct to Cambridge, it means you, you ignore the other waypoints that your flight plan's got, you just fly straight to Cambridge. What's going to happen is, is that when you get towards Cambridge, you're just going to commence the NDV procedure and you just do it at your own discretion. No, and you probably never will again. <laughs> It's outside of controlled airspace, so you sort of get half a service, not a real, real one. Fair enough. <laughs> EC 782 Romeo, there's no further ATC, Unicorn 122 Decimal 8, bye bye. Bye bye, Romeo. I've gone direct to the hold position, so you've landed. You've Gemma Wings 505, are you with us? For God's sake. Hello, Wings 505, good morning to you. Dane to Alpha arrival, climb flight level 220. Alpha arrival, climb Dane to Alpha arrival, climb flight level 220. Yeah. Oh, 
What's the altitude for ILS capture? Uh, apologies, what was the uh, call sign? No. Oh yeah. You better descend then. There's the, there's the airport. Airport. One, one, two, you can't direct, feel you've got. <laughs> there's the airport. Yeah. So, running parallel with it. Right, 901, you can commence the, proce uh, commence the procedure for runway 25 and report uh, beacon outbound. So, start start the procedure as per the charts and just advise you when you've started it, basically. Is that for me? Yeah. Rhino 901, runway 23. Not 25, correct? Should be on the NDB approach, so if you've got the chart for the NDB approach, you're basically routing from Cambridge, i.e. Cambridge is below you, and then you turn yourself from to the uh, the ILS yep. the NDB. Rhino 901, yep, I'm going to go ahead with that. Um, we're perfectly fine, I'm going to go out, turn left, and then intercept the ILS for the runway 23. That's fine, there's no ATC speed restriction, so the speed is yours, you can report final runway 23. Wilco, Rhino 901. Oh, eight, oh, sorry, run at 85, no ATC speed restriction, same instructions for yourself. Um, you can commence the, ND, commence the NDB procedure for runway 23 and report final runway 23. You're, You're running about Rhino 85, thank you. I see now. I got lucky, uh, but yeah, I got it right, but got lucky. It was a bloody good guess. 3828, London Control, hello. Um, I think you're on the wrong set because you should. Are you watching my stream? Right in one six zero degrees, uh, make a left turn. The charts at the moment, but, but if you look at if you quickly look at my screen, I this is what you need to do. I'm cutting the corner, uh, but you need to come uh, in this way to intercept the ILS that way. But I'm right, cutting okay. the corner a little bit, but that's that's fine. What I've done, I've got kind of got away with it, but because I cut it a bit short. But that was what he was trying to get us to do. The Alpha, hello, approach. Zero three five three. Yeah, so yeah. you swoop round. Can you confirm with me um, heading 160? I make a left turn heading 160 degrees. 160 degrees, 2828. 2828, you have to maintain 5,000 feet for time being. I've got traffic above you that I'm not controlling, so once you clear that traffic, I'll uh, climb you up. Roger that, 5,000 feet, uh, 2 Thank you. So we're just going to go out a bit further, guys, and then we're going to swing around to intercept the ILS. Three Fox, my Essex has just come online, so contact Essex on 120 decimal Oh, wow, Essex have just come online. Let's get down quick. Oh, for God's sake. I <laughs> know, right? <laughs> Great, we've got them. That's been like, so I'm mocking it all. Right, Essex was on mic. He probably won't bother to hand us over. Oh my god, this is getting choppy. Getting some chop here. Um, he probably won't hand us over, to be honest. Right there, 901. Right there, 901, go ahead. Essex Radar's just come online. He's aware of what you guys are doing. Uh, so just contact him on 120625 and I'll help you out if he beats. Right there, 901, over to Essex Approach on 120.62. Thank you for your assistance. We won't be coming back here again. <laughs> Take care, Tim. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Ryanair 901 having a fun party going round into Cambridge. Ryanair <laughs> 901, Roger. Confirm you're on the 05, sorry, 071 outbound radio. Ryanair 85, Roger that. Thanks very much for the. Uh, uh, yep, yeah, confirmed, Ryanair 901. 
Two, three. Yep, Wilco, uh, Ryanair 901. Ryanair 901, descend to altitude 1,700 feet. Descend to 1,700 feet, Ryanair 901. <coughs> Essex approach, uh, Ryanair 3, Fox Truck, Mike, um, just vacated runway 22 two standard, uh, requesting taxi to the gate. The three fox show Mike thanks, Juliet, Link Bravo, stand two three. And taxi Juliet, uh, Link Bravo, stand two three, thanks very much for Rhino three fox from Mike. I mean round the mountain when we come. Rhino eight five, Essex. 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 We're getting rainy poos as we come in. Nice. Bit of rain. Rainer 85, hold cancelled. Commence with the procedure. Report outbound from Cambridge. Okay, onto the ILS. Rainer 85, hold cancelled. Commence with procedure. Rainer 85, we're going to try and set the ILS. That's okay. Uh, 85 Roger. Route direct question after Cambridge. Fly heading 085. Uh, fly heading 085 after Cambridge. Ryan 085. Just waiting for the ILS to connect. Down to 180 knots. And then 901 field to your left at uh, 11 o'clock, range 1 1 miles, report the field in flight. Right now 901, uh, we'll go. Uh, got the ILS on, so just wait for it to intercept. Come on ILS, do your job. Connect to the ILS, come on, don't let me down. Otherwise it's gonna be a manual way in. Come on, lock on ILS. One 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 three zero. Surprised it's not picking up the ILS. Well, I mean, it's picking it up, but it's not locking it on. Right, eight five traffic, twelve o'clock, eleven miles. He's uh, three thousand feet below established ILS. Two two. Two three before the site. He's so quiet. Yeah. Much of that traffic is fine. Right, uh, nine zero one traffic left. Two. You're eleven o'clock. 3,000 feet above, and, uh, in the hold at Cambridge, report in sight. Ryanair 901, traffic at uh, hold at 3,000 above, report when it's in sight. I can't find this fucking runway. You're in the clouds at the moment, so. It's <laughs> not helping. And I'm not getting the ILS, so it's going to be a manual landing. Well, I can see you on my radar. Yeah, and and so like we'll try and turn a right slightly to intercept the ILS. You seem to be going on course. Turning slightly to the right to try and intercept the ILS, right now 901. I think we're going to be going in manual, to be fair. Right, uh, the field is to your 12 o'clock at 4, uh, report in sight. 12 o'clock 4. <laughs> Straight in front of you. Runway's over there, no? What's happening? What's happening? Oh, it's alright! Oh, the heavens above the ILS has been intercepted. Ryanair 901. Ryanair 901, perfect. The surface winds 280 degrees at 10 knots. Clear to land, Ryanair 901. I'll never be happier. 
Right, let's get the speed down to 142. Landing gear is down. Here we go, guys. Right, uh, eight five. Turn left. Heading zero five zero degrees. Turn left. left. Heading zero, zero five, five zero, zero degrees. Right now, eight five. Right, guys. Let's do this. Cameras on. Here we go. Three mile final. Thousand feet stabilized, Mr. Birch altitude set. Right now, eight five, turn left at in three, two, zero degrees. Turn left at in three, two, two zero degrees. Approaching two, three. Check. I'm gonna leave the uh, runway. Oh, where the hell? Is it a turnaround runway? Oh, I think it is. Five hundred. Five hundred check. Okay. Plane is mine. Five turn left at two eight five, descent altitude one thousand seven hundred feet, cleared ILS approach, two three. Uh, Rhino eight five, sorry, can you repeat the heading uh, direction? Four thousand feet remaining. Two six zero degrees, and reducing altitude to one seven oh yeah, one thousand seven hundred feet. Eighty knots. Turn around roundabout uh, runway. One thousand remaining. Okay. And then down to the one backtrack runway two three. VK left via Delta. Backtrack runway two three. Exit via Delta Ryanair nine zero one. Welcome to Cambridge, guys. Laps can come off. Put your put your brakes on at least one, if not two. A short runway. Okay, max on brakes. runway <laughs> zero five. You gonna what? Max brakes. Uh, uh, eight five winds two eight zero degrees at one oh, seven knots. Continue approach one to vacate. Telling me to come off at Delta. Right, eight five, sorry, your mic is very quiet there. Eight five, continue approach, one to vacate, surface winds two eight zero degrees up one zero knots. Continue approach, right, eight five, thank you. Vacate Delta. Right now, nine zero one, very quickly, can you confirm Delta as the departure? Because to me, that looks like it's not going to take me to the terminal. Ah, uh, Delta's wrong. Hey, you can take Charlie. No worries, Ryan Air 901. Funny little airport. What did you say? Because it's a funny little airport. You want to try oh. landing at it? <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to assess it though. Tell you what, we made at least two controllers laugh anyway. Yeah. Which, to be fair, is no bad thing. Especially the other one, I really had him in stitches. <laughs> Alright, turning off, so your runway is going to be yours in 10 seconds. Yeah, I'm still about three miles out, mate. Fine. Okay. Managed right to now, 901, hours. clear runway. Right at 901, thanks. Break. Right at 85, service with 26, 0 degrees. Fashion 2 at 0 degrees, 1 0 knots, 1 2 3, clear. Right at 85, thank you. Clear to 1. Right at 
and so I'm not even too sure if there was a terminal or a stand you can park up the taxi wherever you like. Yeah, right now, no worries. Uh, we'll find somewhere to dump it. <laughs> oh my god, I don't think you're even going to fit in here with me. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that's quite funny. I'm gonna go right off to the left and then you can just slot in beside me. The wings might just be touching though. 500. Check. Too white, too red. Oh, he's coming. Here he comes, boys. Right, let's get the parking brake on. And then quickly go out and watch our learning colleague if I go to free camera. Here he comes. Here he comes. Is he going to get bounce number two? Good luck. That's how you do it. That's how you do it without a bouncy. And are we going for a visit off off ground or are we going to stop? We're going to stop. <sighs> good, good. That was better. <laughs> that was better. Yes. Yes, most definitely so, sir. He's got to go and do the turn. He's got to do the turn around here. You know, the, the mistake I made the first time. Yeah. I didn't put my throttle Oh. Okay. Yeah, that would be a mistake. Uh, no, sorry. I didn't put my throttle up when I took off from Cardiff. Yeah. Or, no, uh, Dublin. But because I pressed Toga, it didn't recognise that my throttle was in idle position when I landed. Oh. So it carried on with both But throttles. when you press Toga, you're supposed to push your throttles forward as well. I know, I know, oh. I forgot to do it. <laughs> oh, okay. It's a wonder that the Toga held. I know. Because with mine it doesn't. If I don't push them throttles forward, I got halfway down the runway, about 120, all of a sudden the Toga will disconnect. Right, guys. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed... Day two, episode number two, uh, as you see, with a couple of interesting landings there. Uh, one at Cardiff and now at Cambridge. A little bit more taxing trying to get into Cambridge, but the uh, ATC did a great job. Um, I will see you tomorrow with episode three as we head from Cambridge over to France. Maybe with a proper size airport, we'll see. Uh, so tune in for that. Don't forget to hit subscribe guys as well as hit the like button and uh, I'll see you tomorrow and there will also be a live stream. So if you're watching this today, there will be a live stream again tomorrow. Have a great one guys and uh, I'll catch you tomorrow.